an awful lot of scenes with her. So I think I don't cross over with many other females at all. So <laughs> but um, no, it's, it's great. But uh, I think the transformation um, with Dany is, is a big one, much like Aria and Sandra's. So, um, I th yeah, I think it's, it's easier to talk to um, Amelia as well, because I see her more often. I do see Michelle a lot, but um, uh, I think it's easier to talk to um, Amelia. And uh, it's, it's nice to get things out, well, not things out of them, but, you know, it's nice to get um, sort of tips and stuff. But um, I think, I, oh, I always think if, if they can do it, I can do it type thing. So, um, yeah, but... Uh, <laughs> Any other questions? Uh, we're going to take one from the, the back, a lady raising her arm in kind of a grey shirt. Yes, yes, thank you. In contrast to an earlier question, is there anything that cast are not looking forward to doing or really, really not enjoy having to do during the film? Maybe it's just because you're being blamed on this. <laughs> is there anything the cast really are not looking forward to or really did not enjoy doing? even if it was because they were being rained on? Um, yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, I, can't, I can't say. I'm so sorry. This must be agonising. But no, uh, I can't say. And yes, it was painful <laughs> to do. And that's all I'm going to leave you with. <laughs> um, yeah, there's a couple of bits coming up. Um, not necessarily not looking forward to, but... Uh, not as exciting as some other things, but um, uh, yeah, <laughs> I don't really know. How, I can't really say anything else, but um, yeah. <laughs> we will be handing out tranquilizers at the end of the panel um, for anyone who can't take attention. Um, Christian, anything that really upset you? Um, well, you know, there are, there's some sad scenes, and but I actually, actually quite look forward to doing those. It beats some of the things I've done in season one, haven't we? Um, <laughs> well, let's ask another question of you then, uh, just to annoy you possibly. Um, you're 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 a musician and you've been into music, yes. you know, for a very long time. Um, has it helped or hindered in your in your acting in any way at all? Um. Well, there's two things I think that have helped me with the work. Um, uh, I was quite a shy teenager. I, I learned how to express myself through music, basically, um, non-verbally, which obviously is very handy. Also, I had hearing problems when I was a kid, and um, I learned sign language and stuff. Um, so, obviously, I can communicate without using my voice. Well, uh, it's sort of part and parcel with it. So, uh, I think both of those things have been useful, to be honest. That, that, that is actually really, really interesting. Um, any, anyone have any, any other questions for anybody? Yes, that lady in the second row. Uh, what do you find interesting about the relationships between the characters in your current and upcoming material? You can speak really vaguely, it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, Sansa... Um, Sansa has a few certain relationships with certain characters. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Um, and some of them are really, really interesting. And those that have read the books kind of know what I'm talking about, if I'm not being too vague. Um, and I'm really looking forward to doing those scenes. <laughs> I think... Um, a lot of the uh, relationships change uh, this season, and I think the people you think you can trust, you really can't, and those of you who've read the books sort of know what I'm talking about. But um, uh, I think for the people who haven't, it's going to be a big shock this season for the different things that are going to that happen. But um, yeah, I think the relationships do definitely change, um, but whether they're good or bad, I think is up to sort of someone's personal opinion. <laughs>